Hey friends, hello and welcome to another Photoshop tutorial by PSD World. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to remove people in Photoshop using the clone stamp tool. So let's get started. Here I am using this image from unsplash.com. You can find the link to the image in the description below. Right click and click on layer from background. We will unlock this layer. Select the lasso tool. I will zoom in a bit and create a rough selection around this lady which I am going to remove with the lasso tool. So just draw using the mouse. After we are done selecting, right click and click on layer via cut. We have successfully removed the lady from our image and here is the blank empty spaces. In my previous video I had used the spot healing brush tool and the patch tool to remove people. I am going to use the clone stamp tool this time. Set the hardness to around 30 to 40 percent or maybe even less. Now create a new layer on which we will use this clone stamp tool. Make sure the sample is set to current and below. Hold the alt key to select from where we are going to sample for our filling. If your brush hardness is high then it is going to leave rough edges. So make sure that brush hardness is around 10% to 20% not more than that because if the hardness is high it is going to leave hard edges. Always choose sample from nearby areas so that highlights and shadows are matched up. With a little practice you can easily get from where to choose the area. Here I have chosen the grass area and aligned it with the rest of the image so that everything looks natural. With a little bit of practice you can even get you will easily get how to select the portions. If you select from nearby areas then the highlights and shadows will be perfectly balanced. In my previous video I had shown how to remove people in Photoshop using the spot healing brush tool and the patch tool you might also want to look into that. So after watching this video you can easily go to my YouTube channel and visit these videos. Those are also simple techniques to remove people from the background. So you can see that here with the clone stamp tool I have successfully removed the lady. So this is a very simple tool and uh, if you practice a little bit you can easily get a hold of this. I will just add a hue saturation adjustment layer just to increase the saturation. And I will just add a curves adjustment layer to add a little bit of contrast just to show you how the images are going to look. Now I will just, uh, just group these layers to show you the before and after images. So 
hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial on how to remove people in Photoshop using the clone stamp tool. Do check out my previous video on how to remove people using the spot healing brush tool and patch tool. Also if you love our work at world for phd do support us on paypal. If you want to contribute for our next project become a patron on patreon.com. Do share the video and I would love to hear from you guys how this video helped you and please like this video. Make sure to subscribe to stay up to date with my future content. Take care.